welcome to a new vlog. Ben and I are on our way to Starbucks and we're gonna go to Potbelly after to pick up a sandwich for his sister. Um, I just scratched my head and you can see the marks on my forehead. But this morning, so last night Ben and I like left for like two hours-ish and we got back and Stormy's nose was like getting swollen and I was like okay like it's fine like probably just like an allergic reaction but then this morning his nose got even like it was all swollen so then I like called like the animal hospital and they were like pretty much you can just like give them you can give Stormy Benadryl and then see how it goes and just like make sure you like keep an eye on him and if it gets worse like obviously bring him into the vet but we went to Walmart or I guess I didn't mean to say it, but and we got some Benadryl for him and he's already feeling way better and his nose is like calmed down I think at least like I don't know if his nose has but his his face has like yeah his like his cheeks are really puffy and under his chin was really puffy mm -hmm. but that's all yeah, like his cheeks and like his chin was like all puffy too. And it, you can tell it's like getting less swollen. So that's really good. And we're kind of really tired because like we woke up and then like immediately did all this. So like we're so excited for um, Starbucks. Sleep. I know, maybe a nap too. And then we have some fun things going on today that will be fun right storm but yeah i'll take you guys along i hope you guys enjoy this vlog i really want this mushroom guy i wonder if they sell it <laughs> i might Alright, I'll be right back. Sounds good. <laughs> All done? Mix it up more, maybe? Not terrible, but like, I might as well just get the regular. I got my usual chai tea latte with oat milk. Can't go wrong. It looks like coffee, not coffee. Acts like coffee, isn't coffee. Ben is, Ben ran into a pot belly to get his sister the sandwich and then we're probably I'm just gonna watch YouTube chill with Stormy try to figure out when we go to my mom's later if we're gonna leave him behind at Ben's or bring him the thing is that my mom has two other like big dogs and I just want Stormy to like play with them when he's like has something going on with his nose um, but I want to keep an eye on him. Cut a vibe, yeah. Baby, I am coming through the rhyme. I just want to look into your eyes. We're going to be like on top of the Tesla. to my mom's and do like a little celebration for the fourth and whatever and I need to get ready so I thought I could do a little get ready with me and I could show you some products that I've been using and loving 
I always put on this headband and it makes me look like a flower, I feel like. <laughs> so I put this on to keep everything out of my face. I always wash my hands before I clean my face just to make sure that there's no um, no germs at all. And then today I'm going to wash my face with this Vanny cream. I really love this. My face loves to get loves when I switch up my face stuff, so I'll do the Vanny cream today. So while this is soaking into my face, soaking, while this is soaking into my face, I'm gonna brush my teeth. And I just use like Tom's Luminous White. Mm. I just realized that my electric toothbrush died yesterday so I'm gonna find the charger so after I wash my face brush my teeth um, I usually use my gua sha but I lost it and I so I just broke my other one bought a new one and I lost it like I have no idea where it went so maybe like, I look like everywhere so, since I can't find it, I'm gonna use some of these tools and just like kind of get rid of like this unwanted hair around my eyebrows. <laughs> so I just use like this thing and you just like press this button. And, like... Cause since my eyebrows are so light, there's no point in me getting them um, like wax. I do, Get the wax on like special occasions, but like usually like I'll just use this because you can barely even see them. And now I'm gonna try to find one more time the gua sha. I have no idea where it's at, so I'm just gonna clean my ears. I just have like the saline wound wash to clean my cartilage piercings and like my um, industrial. I'm afraid that I left my gua sha in like Delton when we went because I know I used it there. I don't remember seeing it. I don't know. It was only like eight bucks anyway, but it's just the fact that I just got it and now I just use it every single day. Now I can't use it. So after I do that stuff, use this Clinique. Just like the gel hydrant one. There's another one, but that's for skin that isn't dry. Mine's more dry, so I use this one. And then I love using the Paula's Choice C15 Super Booster. I can definitely tell that it makes my face like brighter. So I just do like three pumps of this. And then I'll put like two little drops and two, one, two, two little drops into the lotion and I just put it all on my face. And since Ben and I will be in the boat like later, I'm not gonna put any sunscreen on. If I did do sunscreen, it'd be right after like I put the moisturizer on. I just rub it all over my neck. Usually then I'll do the gua sha so it just glides nicely, but I don't know where it went. I'll honestly probably find it when I get back to my apartment next week. Okay. After that, since I don't have that much counter space, I just put everything away right after. And now my face is prepped and then I have all my makeup in this. I make sure my sponge is nice and damp. And then I have this Dior foundation that I use. And then I just like, sometimes I just put it right on my face. Sometimes I put the foundation on the brush first. And then I just 
dab a lot. I just ran out of my Ilia, which I use a lot more. Um, and that shade is like perfect for my skin. This one's a little more orange and uh, um, darker, so I have to blend it in a lot better. But it helps to blend when the sponge is like more damp. So honestly, like usually when I'm putting in on my foundation, I like walk around like everywhere so I'm not like staring at my face and like making sure I get everything I just kind of walk around and then I come back and look <laughs> once it's blended in for the most part then I look and see if I have like any like big pimples which I don't really right now if I did I'll put concealer on and then now I'll do the mineral powder well I just use this Neutrogena skin clearing mineral powder from like Target and I just it makes it lighter and like makes the foundation blend in a little better. For my brows, I just use this Maybelline Brow Extensions. I used to do like the Anastasia from like Sephora or whatever, but it was just like kind of like too like I didn't want to spend that much on something that I could is like the exact same. Um, so it's like a crayon. And I just kind of blend a little more so they're not as defined. I like the more natural look. Love using the Ilia mascara. Just love how like thick like the brushes and like the handle it makes it a lot easier going on. I go in with either the Pixie, which I love the Pixie blush one, um, or I go with this color stick. They're pretty close. This one's just a little lighter, so it's a less more blush. So I'm going to use this one, and then I always put this on top of either one just to make it more shimmery. Put on my cheeks and nose. My eye is twitching. And since I'm feeling a little swaggy, I go in with this jumbo, it's an eye pencil, and it's in milk. It sometimes gets stuck though. If I just put this in the corner of my eyes, I'm gonna get changed and I'll come back. Just got changed. I wore this yesterday, we Ben and I went to some fireworks for a little bit, and then I'm gonna put on my Reebok platforms. I don't think I'm going to do anything too crazy with my hair. Okay. Just do this. A little braid action. I don't know if I like it because now I can't like go like this, but I'll keep my sunglasses on. So. Okay, and then I'm gonna use, I use this Native, the Aloe and Green Tea, and then I love using the Frenchy perfume. It, it lasts for like the whole day. Okay, and then I'm gonna get Ben, have to wake him up. Look at Ben and Stormy. I hope they're still on their same as well. But I have to show you what they look like. Okay, we just got back from my mom's. I am just so smart that I didn't video anything. <laughs> Um, and I had a few white claws. Oh, did not realize my nose ring was twisted. Can't get it back. Huh. Oh. Okay, I'm just gonna brush my teeth to move off. It was such a good time. I did get hit with a firework ash on my forehead. Um, it was a big brown spot right in the middle. Thank God I'm still alive. I'm just kidding. Um, no, but it was a really good time. I saw a firework ash on here. I don't know if you guys can see. Say hi to the vlog. What up? <laughs> Say nice. Come here. Come here, man. <laughs> ben, can you show yourself? <laughs> I'm tickling Ben's back. 
take off some makeup, wash my face, and then I have some gummy worms, and then that's when I'm going to brush my teeth later. What do you mean you didn't actually watch it? What? Huh? <laughs> Rick and Morty. Rick. Rick and Morty. Just took off my makeup and everything, and now I'm gonna be getting ready for bed. So I will see you guys in the morning. Good morning, Stuart. Say hello. Stormy's nose is doing a lot better today. Let me see if I can show you. We just have been giving him Benadryl like once a day. So we gave him one yesterday with some ham, and then today with some ham. And you could definitely tell like it's not even swollen like at all anymore if anything maybe a little on like the tip of his nose but I'm so glad that he's doing better because I have no idea like what happened or whatever I said whatever like five times I'm also going to switch to over this side I think um and my ears so itchy Ben and the just went golfing with his mom and grandpa so they're gonna have a good time even though it's like I think it's 90 degrees and like super humid I'm just here i'm going to uh, probably watch some uh, my ears so itchy probably just gonna watch some tv or youtube while i put these clothes away clean up my area maybe do some laundry we have to do clean our sheets and clean the towels again stormy just got this new purse from coach and my lipstick exploded so i have to go clean it and like the inside and i don't know how to clean the inside cleaned this out and while i was cleaning i dropped it in the sink as i mentioned earlier in this vlog i lost my gua sha so i've been like kind of like cleaning like in depth so i have like i brought all my um bathroom stuff out here to try and organize everything so i have this which is like full of my hair stuff this which is like full of like bigger bottles this which i love this coach one so much um has just like toothbrush toothpaste like q-tips like the immediate stuff that you need and then i have this for something i can organize and put stuff in this very bradley one which i love so much the inside is so pretty too and it has like this material where it's just like perfect and then I have this little philosophy bag has some stuff in it um and then this one which you have seen in the other vlog that I got from Marshalls which I love a lot so I'm going to try and organize I need to take off these tags first on the Vera Bradley and the philosophy one because I just got the Vera Bradley one and then the philosophy one I just haven't taken off yet. So I have nail clippers. Okay. Yeah, I don't know where my gua sha went and I'm worried that I left it behind. I'm gonna try to organize this and then I'll come back. finished up organizing this the best that I can right now so I'm gonna walk you through what I put in each of the bags so I have this very badly one that I ended up just putting in all like well I have a makeup bag already so I put like lotions and things that like if they were to spill it would be okay in this bag because of that protectant seal on the inside 
um, fabric. So I just have like all my um, lotions, my bum bum cream, this face mask, my Paula's Choice, my lavender scented stuff that I got from the lavender farm when I went to like Delton. And then I have in this one, since it doesn't have the protective seal inside, I just have like my headband, my comb, not my comb, my hairbrush, and then my, I guess it's my face wash or my lotion. Um, but it can stand upwards so it's not gonna leak in there. And then in here, I still have all my hair stuff that I brought, plus my lipsticks in this little container. And then just put the little rubber band and tied it really tight to keep this inside and not coming out of it. And then I have so many <laughs> makeup things. This one just has like these things that um, Ben's mom was getting rid of that she said that I could have. So like face masks, some like rosehip oil and stuff like that. And then in this one, I have my perfumes on this side, all my sunscreens, my face sunscreen and my two body ones. And then on this side, I have just all like the little things like the castor oil for my eyebrows and eyelashes, some razors, my um, tongue scraper. That's what the word's called, <laughs> my tongue scraper. And then my face patches for pimples. And then last but not least, I have this coach one that just has my deodorant, my face serum, and my CBG oil. That It works perfectly in this because it has like a little compartment that they stand like upwards and those two fit perfectly in there. Um, have uh, my razor, floss, q-tips, and that's it. And then uh, I have it like literally, I have to show you guys how many I have down here. <laughs> um, but I didn't end up using this Vera Bradley one, which is okay, I'll probably use it another time when I travel somewhere else, but look at all of it. Look at all of them. <laughs> Six, that's a lot for them, but I still haven't found the gua sha. Okay, I just put all my stuff like right down here and then all my face stuff and little things right on top. And I think it looks pretty good. Um, there were like two things like my hair stuff and that random bag of things I just like put in my duffel bag because I don't need to be in here because I don't use that stuff like always. But yeah, I think this looks a lot better and more organized. Maybe just more bags, but still. <laughs> Happy 5th of July. Oh wait, I forgot to end off the vlog yesterday, but... I hope you guys had a good 4th of July and I will see you guys in my next vlog.